again. Let's go play some uh, Danganronpa V3 then. Uh, we're gonna do the Salmon Run. It's loud in your ears, you can just lower the volume. Yeah, but I've noticed like when I lower the volume, it seems to lower it for you guys too. It's really weird. Uh, but yeah, uh, we're gonna play Love Across the Universe. It's the music, not the voices. Okay. But yeah, we're gonna be doing this. And if you guys have a certain character that you'd want me to spend time with, uh, let me know. And I think, uh, let me show you the characters that I have maxed report cards with. So, this is the stages that we're at. I'm Kaito. Two for Oma. We maxed out Kibo, so no hanging out with Kibo. Max up Kidu. Oh, let me read her report card actually. She's taken down a crime syndicate. She's perfect, but she's experienced failure. She once coddled one of her masters too much. So she became totally dependent on her. She has since vowed to never make that mistake again. Hey yo? That's me. We don't want Elio's ears to be broken. Yeah, I just took one of the earbuds out of my ear. <laughs> I do that a lot when I stream, actually. I'll have, like, loud music, but I'll only have it play in one ear. She says that she sees even more potential in me. She wants to serve me as a maid, completely free of charge. I promised her that I would consider her offer after we escape. Increased bed making, Hey. Increases the recovery speed of the focus card. I don't really need that anymore. We got Himiko at 2, Maki at 3. We don't need to hang out with Sumugi. Uh, we got Miyu at 1 and Kaide at 1. Oh yeah, let's read this. Ultimate pianist, so talented that VIPs from across the world come to watch her perform. But she lost all of that off, saying that she'll always be known as the piano freak. God. You want me to hang out with Angie? Okay, I'm gonna do my salmon fishing. So you guys can discuss while I fish for salmon. Who you want me to spend time with. I just noticed that Samuki likes foam. <laughs> Any other person I can just down on foam? Okay, I'm gonna do a max bet. I think I think I make more bang from that. I'm not sure. Kaede. Alright, I got one vote for Kaede. Okay, that this is green. This is green. Get a good reward. Not yet, that was red. Gimme. Green. Red. Blue red. Green. Blue. Where is it green? Okay, there it is. Water the fish, I mean bunny. Oh, thank you for the high tier pizza. Hello. Welcome, welcome. Kaide? Okay, we got two votes for Kaide, so it looks like we'll be hanging out with Kaide then. <clears throat> thank you, Pika. I'm, I'm very hydrated. 
I'll, I'll grow to become a very strong bunny. Okay, now let's trade this in. Uh, I think I'm doing pretty okay. I think I'm gonna conserve these coins. The bunny is pretty fishy. Oi! You can stay small, I don't mind. <laughs> yeah, I probably will stay small. <laughs> We'll stay four foot seven forever. <laughs> Saved an allowance of a hundred coins from the casino. Alright, how should I spend my day today? We're gonna hang out with Kaide. I I bet you since you can only get Kaide's events in this game mode, I'm gonna guess her last one is gonna make me wanna cry. <laughs> You came to invite me? Yes, I would like to spend time together with you. What do you want to do? Since we're already outside, do you want to move around? Small is cute and better to cuddle. <laughs> well, thank you. Oh, yeah. How about we go on a nice stroll and just talk? Yeah, how you doing, Pikachu? How's your day going? Kaide and I went on a stroll, talking together. Kaide and I grew a little closer today. I'm doing Genshin. Ooh, what you working on? I, are you working on Sumeru? Since I know you said you 100%ed Inazuma. What you working on? Ooh, the events first. Oh yeah, there's that one uh, fighting event going on right now, right? Okay, what what items does Kaide like? Oh, uh, Kaide gifts. What gifts does Kaide like? Let me see. High end, of course. High end, head, oh yeah, the tattered music score. I think I have a lot of those. Oh, I only have one, but it's fine. It's enough. I have one. Switchy, I'm just so ecstatic. I thought I had been the only one looking at you, but I guess you noticed me too. <laughs> and then Leela, probably. I completely skipped Leela because I, I speeded the story to get to Inazuma for Kokomi material. <laughs> Understandable, honestly. Kokomi is super cute. I kind of want to pull for her it, whenever she gets a. a a rerun. <laughs> <laughs> I think that because you gave me such a pretty gift. Ah, she's blushing. There. Hey, Shuichi. Oh, uh, what? You scared me getting that close. Oh, Oops, sorry. I just got super excited. <laughs> what is it? Huh. Let's play a piano duet together. <gasps> a piano duet? Like an Evangelion? That's okay. gay! Oh, right. You don't know yet. A duet is when two people play on the same piano. Are we gonna, like, touch hands while we play on the piano? And then you look at me? With, like, a very seductive look in your eyes? And then I blush and scooch over in the seat? And then you go ham on the piano? <clears throat> you can do that? Of course, since a piano has 88 keys. Now she mentions it, I suppose pianos are pretty wide. Gakomi is a good healer, and it fully builds on HP, a good DPS too. Oh yeah, is... I think... It is her tower healer? Because I got a hotel, and I know I was told to get a good healer for my team. <laughs> I want you to know more about the piano. And that's why a duet with you would be perfect. Imagine not having a boyfriend to do piano duets with. <laughs> right? The Kami only heals with her ultimate. Aw, oh, man. With her burst. Dang it. Okay, yeah, I'll probably pull for Kokobi then, because I prefer having a healer on my team instead of having food. I like cooking, but I like keeping the food. I don't know, I'm weird. 
Chi Chi can also be a good heal. I've been wanting to get Chi Chi. I've been pulling on the the blue whenever I get them. And I just can't get her. I have Mona and I have Kuchin, but I just can't get Chi Chi. Wait a minute. What's wrong? Huh? What's wrong? Is there a problem? Anosa. It's just it's such an honor to perform with you. I, I don't know. No. Whatever, I'm just a normal high school girl. Bro, you played for the president. <laughs> uh, but I've never played piano before. It's okay, as long as you know the first couple beats of Nickelvania, you can consider yourself a genius. I told you guys about how I did that, right? <laughs> well, thank you for the headset, Overtaker. Noelle can also heal, but not really usable as a high stack healer. I will use Noelle just because I like Noelle. <laughs> but yeah, uh, around like Christmas time, uh, where I live, there's like a there's a piano that they just kind of leave out there. And I, I went there and I, I was waiting for like an Uber to come, and I, I just sat there trying to figure out how to play Megalovania on the piano. And then these stupid kids came and they bashed their hands at the piano, and I was like, bro, what the fuck? Like, they just beat it up, and I'm like, bro, that's like gonna ruin the keys. Like, a, a lot of the keys already, like, weren't working properly, because it's just been, like, outside. And, like, I guess a lot of kids do that to the piano. So, like, I was trying to play a bunch of keys and try to find a way to play Megalovania on the keys. But, like, if I was able to start the beat, like, another key that, that's part of Megalovania wouldn't work. So I had to keep finding, like, different, like, pitches to try and do Megalovania in. <laughs> if you beat up the piano, I will beat you up. Yeah, I just... Why do kids think it's cool to, like, beat the shit out of stuff? Like, you don't look cool, bro. Like, people, like banging their fists against the wall. Like, what, you think you look cool? No. No. What, your hand hurts like shit now? Yeah. Makes sense, idiot. Yeah. Everyone's like that in the beginning. You gotta try new things anyway. Move it. Oh! Oh, we're in here. I soon found myself in Kaide's lab in front of her piano. Yours? Okay, let's start practicing. Sit in front of the piano, Shuichi. Uh, okay. He actually gets to play with her. Now, put your fingers on the keys. Like this? Oh, don't place your fingers flat. Keep your fingers light and don't press the keys too hard. Like this? Can you hold my hand and show me? Bend them a little more. Pretend you have an egg in your hand. Wait, is that an actual strat? To pretend you have an egg? Good night, Glitz! I'm gonna touch your hands, okay? So you know how to play in the correct form. <laughs> yes, thank you. Thank you. Oh. Uh, uh. She's so close. Touching me. Soft. Warm. Ah! Was the horny tail himself? Please don't ask. I'm a bad maid. What did you do? <laughs> what am I thinking about? She hasn't noticed. So, so. Okay, just like that. Make sure only your fingertips touch the keys. Are it? Hmm? Shuichi, you don't look very focused. Yeah, the egg thing is real. We also use the cloud method. Hold on, I'm trying to do it with my hands. Like, pretend that I'm holding an egg. An egg. Oh, I guess it could give you, like, a good spread on the keys, huh? What's the cloud method? Let's see. I I'm sorry, I'll do it right this... It's just really hard. Aren't you a little too close? Ah, uh, I don't know what one to choose. Oh no. What one did... 
But when sh would she like? <laughs> Man. Mm. Okay. Uh, I, get I guess it doesn't matter, right? It doesn't matter. I'll go with uh, aren't you a little no 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 no. You're not a little too close. You're 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 just where you should be. Where where I want you to be actually, Kylie. So I'm sorry, I'll do it right this time. Well, you're pretty motivated now. I'm happy to see you so interested. I did nothing but my mind is all over. Oh, are you sleepy or something? Honey. Good. She doesn't think I'm weird. Tend to have a cloud under your hand, so you're all floaty and light. Oh, is that why? Like, I see when people play, like, piano, they kind of, like, bring their hands up, and it looks... And it looks like they're, like, doing little motions with it that looks floaty. Okay, so that, that's why they do that. I'm learning more about piano every day. <laughs> you look so relieved all of a sudden. It's not like I'm gonna scold you or anything. <laughs> oh, I see. I see, Pikachu. No worries. I, I, I won't ask. I won't ask. <laughs> yeah, get get some rest soon. Oh, if you're tired. <laughs> Take it easy. You <laughs> could stay in Okay. Oh, that was cute. I was hoping they would hold hands with her showing him how to play the piano. I spent some time teaching me the basics. But it was so close to me the whole time, I had trouble focusing. And now I know why they called her the piano freak. <laughs> I'm not redeeming Gong Chat. This time, thank nice, you, Saya. Twy. <laughs> yeah, you're pretty good, Chuichi. I think you can play a basic song now. So cool. do -do 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 -do. You think so? Uh, I'm not that good. You're just a great teacher, Kaide. Mm. Well, the great Kaide Akamatsu is saying you can, so be more confident. Do it to why I deserve it, as in you behaved well and want to get bombed? <laughs> yes? <laughs> That's a little... <laughs> Kidding about the great part. <laughs> yeah, thanks. I feel a bit more confident now. Well, alright. We just get the bonk stick ready. <laughs> Give me one moment. That was bonk worthy. <laughs> well, alright then. With pianos, music will play as long as you press the keys. There are a bunch of people who have taught themselves and went a long way. Okay, there we go. There we go. There's the bonk stick. Thank you. I mean, no! <laughs> That's me like you want to be bumped. <laughs> All right, Pika. It's time to get bumped. Get ready. I'm winding up. What? Go to horny jail. Bonk, 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 bonk. <laughs> and I'll even... It's been a while. It's been a while since I've done this. Where's the... Where's the image? There it is. There's the image. Da da Oh yeah. Come on. Do it, do it properly. Da 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 The court finds Pikachu guilty of <laughs> being horny. <laughs> Dancing lobsters. Take them away. <laughs> I think that would look more epic with the model not lagging all over the place. Yeah. <laughs> Hold on. Let me see how it looks if I do it like this. I can't like monitor this very well though. If I'm like this. Okay, let me, let me move myself down over here. Oh, wrong thing. Wrong thing. Where is it? 
Where is it? Right here? Yeah, right here. Right here. Okay. Ooh, did it. Stop moving down. Okay, I think I can do better bonks when I'm like this, maybe. We'll see. I don't know. I don't know if that looked better or not. <laughs> but I can't I can't see it from where I'm at. Because I'm busy with the model, like moving it. So I can't I can't see what it looks like for you guys. But anyways. <laughs> Merry Christmas. A mod pool. Are there any mods in chat right now? Let me see. Mods! Doko! I come back to bumps, but also they can't take me away. Like, the good headmaid I am. I put myself in already. Eh? Oh, sorry. One moment. Tech supporting. No worries. No worries. We, ju we just have a mod pool, so you can you can make up whatever pool you want to make. Also, hello, Mama Kos. Welcome, welcome. There are a bunch of people who have taught themselves and went a long way. So you'll be fine, Shuichi, since I'll be here to teach you everything. You can't take me away. Like the good headmate I am, I put myself in already. That is true. That is true. I can't get rid of Pikachu. I don't want to get rid of Pikachu. <laughs> She'll be here. Cute. They're so cute. I played until Kaide and I were satisfied. Then returned to my room. What is with me? <laughs> You're tired, Pikachu. <laughs> Still have some time. What should I do? Uh, let me just fucking. Uh. <laughs> what we doing? What the cat do? Alright, Kaide. Time to hang out. Oh, wait, actually, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I need to make. I, I need to make sure I have items that you like. Give me just. Give me just one moment. One moment, one moment. Um, what does she like? Because I ran out of the tattered music, so okay, metronome. So that is. Is that a thing that Kofari uses? Are you a Kofari? Okay, I have quite a lot of metronomes. Okay, I'll be fine. Okay, I think I can get through all her events without needing buy anything. That's good. Pika has been influenced by Elio Down Bad Lappy. <laughs> huh? You came to invite me? Whatever could you mean, Twy? I'm... I'm very pure. Eto. What do you want to do? Since we're already outside, do you want to move around? Oh yeah, we're gonna go on a stroll. I like going for strolls. I think it would be cute. To like go out for picnics and stuff. Like, I feel like everyone goes to like restaurants and stuff, but I, I think it would be nicer. Like I'm going on dates to just kinda like enjoy nature and like eat good food. What is this? Best girl. I can't put all the girls on, so I only put the ones that could feasibly be voted for. Okay. Um, Okay, Kirumi is on here. Good. Okay. <laughs> I I put in my vote. Yeah, you're pure. Pure evil. Hey! Isn't that a good thing though? I get more like my master. That is true. And you know what? You know what they say, chat? The chat reflects the streamer. So wait, but Tenko. Does anyone does anyone think Tenko is best girl? <laughs> I can accept the Miyu and Samuki slander. But not Tenko. <laughs> Would you say the other girls on the list are worse than Tenko though? <laughs> I have no idea who are those people. 
yeah, they're, they're from this game. I don't think she is, but I prefer her on, over Angie. Yeah, I, I actually think I prefer her over Angie too, actually. Shuichi, I'm just so ecstatic. And Angie has a cool Dempsey role. Honey. I thought I had been the only one looking at you, but I guess you've noticed me too. What is this? Oh, this! Oh, that, that you... <laughs> that gift. <laughs> yeah, I do like that. That's cute. <laughs> okay, let's see. Who, who's winning the best girl polls? Okay, we got a vote for Kaede, two votes for Himiko, one vote for Kirumi, one vote for Maki. Anji's getting no votes. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. Notice he can vote more with points. <laughs> Shit, can I vote more with points? Oh, I can't. I can't, because I have infinite points. I can't cheat the system. <laughs> I think that because you gave me such a pretty gift. <laughs> you actually came to do it, Pacus. <laughs> yeah. Yours? Then, let's start. You gonna hold my hand some more? <sighs> Let's end it here for today. Mm. I feel like I'm getting a lot better. Mm. Definitely. I honestly think you have the talent to play the piano, Shuji. Ah, Himiko won the best girl polls. Hmm, I wonder who voted on this. There's 12 votes. <laughs> hmm. I wonder. <laughs> could it be? I did one, I swear. Well, I could only vote once. I see. But I did vote Himiko. Wait, we gotta... We got someone here voting a lot. Okay, but Sundorf only voted four times. <laughs> Ty! <laughs> Y'all going all in on Himiko, huh? I voted Maki. Maki is very good. I, I I think if Kirumi was not a maid, I think Maki would be my favorite of the girls. I didn't want to rat him out. <laughs> I lied. <laughs> you liar! Is it ratting out if it's literally on the full screen? <laughs> If you practice more, you might become the new ultimate pianist. Yeah, yeah I, I, I honestly did see that. <laughs> I didn't go into the details on it. Uh, I don't know about that. And besides, this is just practice. I still can't believe Elio missed that prediction that said, Is Elio gullible? Wait, what? It was unanimous that he was gullible to- Wait, what? When did that happen? When did that happen? Some joy contributed. Okay. When? I got like 10,000 channel points for that. Oi. Oi. When did this happen? You're right. It's good to practice, but we should focus on getting out of here together. I want to escape already so I can get to know the other students. Yeah, and there was a prediction for is Elia's gullible. When did this happen? I mean, my favorite is the mind goblin. What? What is going on when I'm not looking at chat? Together. Yeah. Hey, Kaide. Yeah. Hmm? What is it? Anosa. This might sound weird, but what's the matter? You can tell me. Eto. Um, but if it's something hard to answer, then that might be a problem. I mean Dong and Rompa, the mind goblin. Oh Himiko? <laughs> Don't you remember? It was when you added the gaslight to me. The gaslight. 
gaslighting me right now? No, not Himiko. You're being a girl boss right now, Twy. How can you be so optimistic? Emphasis on gold. I hate you. Oy. Oy. <laughs> Damn it, he's not falling for it. So be it. Did you guys plan this out? Thank you for the head pat to overtake her. Don't you fucking bully the bun. <laughs> Thank you. At least, at least someone here <laughs> is nice. <gasps> How can you be so optimistic, huh? You're always talking about cooperating and working together and not giving up. I'm just amazed every time you talk like that. No, I suppose it's easy to talk like that. Don't you? F <laughs> no, I'm, I'm doing a completely related, unrelated bit. That's why he's ruining it. <laughs> I think Dwarf just understood quickly, though. <laughs> you guys are playing mind games with each other without realizing it. <laughs> Damn. But I know that you truly feel that way inside. I suppose I'm just. Asking you where those feelings come from. Heidi looks troubled, yeah. What? Why do you look upset? Oh, damn it, I just wanted to talk about the mind goblin. Himiko? Oh, I'm sorry, I guess it was weird. Oh, no! What's the mind goblin? <laughs> Oh, not at all. It, I'm not mad or troubled or anything like that. at you. you. You succeeded at making me angry at you. I hope you're proud. That yeah, there, there's your gift. Yeah, that's fine. Oi! You shouldn't be happy! You shouldn't be happy that I'm upset with you! Blech! Stupid mind goblin. Mind goblin is nice! Stupid, 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 stupid. Burn in hell, yeah, masochist. Masochist, I tell you. Masochist, everyone in chat is a masochist. You guys have problems, you guys have issues. You guys like this. You guys are masochists and sadists at the same time. Go ahead, shoot me. I won't die. <laughs> I'm low-key shocked you hadn't caught on since Dwarf said it was a bit. I'm not the smartest crayon in the box. I need the sharpest tool in the shed, okay? What did I do? <laughs> it's okay. Oh wait, uh, oh wait, I accidentally did that. I didn't want to do that. <laughs> okay, back back to the game. Back to the game. Oh not at all. I'm not mad or troubled or anything like that. 
I was just thinking about how I could explain it to you. Since my feelings come from actual experience. Oh, actual experience? You were in a situation like this before? Mm. No, not that. There's no way I could have been in this kind of situation in the past. Anone? Well, in my experience, music has always reached other people's hearts. Music? So they are. I told you this before. I play the piano because I want to see people smile. Anone? Redeeming bonk chat six times. That was a good thing. Overtaker did a good thing. You do deserve to get bonked six times. Everyone's faces light up from my performances. I can smile with strangers who I had just met a minute ago. Even if we don't speak the same language, we can bond anyway through music. Yeah, put on that near automata soundtrack. I think it's because we can see other people's true personalities through music. So I'll be fine. I know I can overcome anything just by creating a bond. Baby girl. So that it. Yeah. I suppose that's true, Kaide. Anone. I want to see more smiles from people, so I plan to do all sorts of things. Classical music is my main focus, but I want to do a performance with pop music. Oh, I, I know the perfect pop music singer you should pair up with. Her name's Sayaka. Soda! Oh yeah! Wouldn't it be super fun arranging music for famous games or movies? I can compose the songs however I like and then hold a concert. That would be cool. Kaede. Uh, I think ne. that's a wonderful dream, Kaede. I'm sure that you can do it. You'll be this generation's Yuki Kajiura. Ne. Really? You think so? Mm. Absolutely. And I'd like to come to that concert. Mochiro. I'll definitely invite you. I'll send you the first ticket. Oh, hold on. Aww. I uh, I just told you my dream. <laughs> That's embarrassing. She's so cute when she blushes. I can't believe you got me to blurt out my secret, Shuichi. I wasn't crying or anything. But I'm glad she told me. Oh, they're so cute together. Kaede had calmed down a bit. I returned to my room. I like how, like, Kaede's events are, are so nice and wholesome, and then chat's here just being like, oh yeah, funk me harder with the, the bat. <laughs> be, be pure. Be more wholesome, chat. Perfect. I was thinking of inviting you too. Yeah, let's spend some time together. I was so focused on the piano that I still don't get what's happening in this world. I see how it is. Do you? Do you? <laughs> this is a great opportunity. I was hoping you would teach me what it's like to be a detective. Oh, Elio, you know what else is wholesome? Someone literally commissioning NSFW art of you. You're fine with that. I just do a little hee hee ha ha and I'm a pariah. <laughs> when you say it like that, it does sound bad. Oh, some of these nuts. Oi. I hate it here. This is a great opportunity. I was hoping you would teach me what it's like to be a detective. You guys be nice to me. Say something nice to me. I spent some time teaching Kaide about detectives. We watched Detective Conan. Kaide and I grew a little closer today. I mean, granted, they are also getting a safer work version, and they respect your boundaries and won't show you the NSFW one. Yeah. Like, she's being pretty respectful, I think. And like, 
she asked me permission if it was okay, and I was like, yeah, as long as you don't like post it in public spaces, don't show it to me. If I don't want to see it, then you're good. Something nice to me. I, I didn't mean it like that. <laughs> Good. It's probably the best and most honest way to tell someone I'm making pornography of you. <laughs> By all measures. <laughs> so it's a lot worse when you put it like that. Okay, well, let me give you that metronome. I'm just so ecstatic. I thought I had been the only one looking at. Oh yeah, she already said this before. I don't. I don't need to read this. Yes. All right. Let's do some practicing. Sweetie, I think this is a good place to stop. So let's end here for today. Uh, done already? Yeah. Well. Whenever we see each other, we play the piano together, right? Oh, do you want to do something different? Do you want to play the cello instead? Feels like I'm forcing you to do this. No, it's fine. We can play a different instrument. We can play the flute together. Wait. Probably can't play the flute together. Don't think that's possible. <laughs> You're not having fun, are you, Shuichi? No, I'm having a blast! I'm learning Megalovania! No way, I'm having lots of fun. <gasps> really? Okay, then let's do it again. Since I told you my secret, you're gonna have to tell me yours. Oh, I wet my bed until I was in the first grade. What? Why? <laughs> Because I've decided we're talking about you today. We are? You're so pushy today. Is something bothering her, maybe? Well, if you want me to, but what should I talk about? If I admitted that to someone and they said what, why, I would whoop their ass. <laughs> why would anyone even question that? Like, you're a kid. Sometimes you can't control that. What do you mean, why? I was like eight. Yeah, I still... <laughs> I told you guys about my first day in kindergarten, right? God. I don't remember like hardly anything about kindergarten, but I could never forget my first day of kindergarten. What one? The one where I peed my pants. <laughs> uh... It was the first day of kindergarten, or maybe it wasn't the first day. Maybe it was just a, a regular day of kindergarten. And like, we were sitting all together in a circle in class. And I, I raised my hand and I was like, teacher, can I go to the bathroom? I gotta go pee. And then my teacher was like, no, you will wait until recess. And so I tried. I tried really hard to hold it in until Reese's. But I wound up peeing on the floor. And like the kids next to me had to like spring up and like grab paper towels and shit. But at the same time, even though I was a kid, I was still like, should have just let me use the bathroom? <laughs> What the fuck do you think I'm gonna do? I, I need to use the bathroom. Just let me go to the bathroom. What, you think I'm gonna go in the bathroom and like light up a cigarette? I'm like four years old. Like, what's the problem? Dude, that's shitty. What's wrong with teachers? You're like four, yeah. I still remember that, like looking back on it. I'm just like, what was wrong with the teacher? Just let me use the bathroom. Like. You think a kindergartner's not gonna pee themselves if you don't give them permission to use the bathroom? Like, and, and they like that in high school too. I remember a lot in high school, like my teachers would be like, no, wait until the period is over. And it's like, what if like someone's on their period? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know, man. Like, just, just let people use the bathroom. 
if, if they stay in there too long, then maybe you could get them in trouble for that. But like, people have bladders. That That's actually one of the reasons why I dislike working alone at my workplace. It hasn't happened yet, but I've always had the thought like, what if I need to use the bathroom? And there are like a bunch of customers. I have to tell them like, I gotta go take a piss real fast. <laughs> you know? You know what pisses me off? Teachers aren't that understanding in university. That's the biggest lie ever. Yeah. Teachers... I feel like teachers in university just like don't give a shit. They're like, yeah, go use the bathroom. Just go. They just leave, you know? Uni teachers are way more understanding than in high school. Yeah, high school teachers got like a, a stick up their ass, but like... I feel like university teachers are just like, uh, if you show up, you show up. Eh? If you don't come back after using the bathroom, you don't come back after using the bathroom. It's whatever. I feel like uni teachers are a lot more chiller. Unless you get like, okay, my Japanese teacher was not chill. My Japanese teacher sucked, and I think that's why she got fired after that semester. <laughs> Cause she, she just like, she had no amount of chill. At worst, uni teachers don't want you to use a phone in class, yeah. Like, I could wear a hoodie with like earphones and a, a face mask at, in, in uni. And that was to like give me comfort because I, I have like, you know, I don't know, just sensory issues, I guess. Uh, and they were totally cool with it, but uh, you know, what is this? What should I talk about? Pee pants. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> yeah, we'll talk about me peeing my pants. Yeah, yeah, Kaede. Kaede. Wanna hear about that time I peed my pants in kindergarten? <laughs> <laughs> Amazing. At best, high school teachers will give you a warning instead of punishment. Yeah. Freaking dwarf, how'd you come up with this stuff? <laughs> I remember middle school was rough, but I went to like a juvenile middle school. We had to run laps. Like the entire class had to run laps. If like one kid in our class pissed off the teacher. Mental derangement. <laughs> How about your hobbies? Mm. Hobbies? Um... <gasps> huh? You have to think about your hobbies? <laughs> well... I don't want to say all I would do is watch Detective Conan. I remember helping out with the detective business. Also, I'm pilot autopiloting because I'm trying to roll the stupid Effie engaged ring gotcha. Good luck, Dwarf. Who are you trying to get? So that I suppose being a detective is my hobby. Oi, 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 wanna fight, but I'm not saying watching Detective Conan is bad. <laughs> I would get why you would be embarrassed to say all you do is watch anime, though. I haven't. I think my coworkers know that I'm a weeb. Because I think they've seen me open my phone. Because I have art of myself. I'm a narcissist on my phone. So... I think a few of them know I'm a weeb. And I noticed the one coworker with the Akatsuki fucking AirPods container. You can't hide it from me. I know what you are. But I don't want people to know I'm a weeb, you know? I don't know, I get embarrassed. <laughs> I get embarrassed because I'm still like, oh... Like an anime, it's like, nerd. Off, right? I'm just gonna look down on me. Anyway, thank you for the hydrate, Overtaker. Oh, bondings give minor stat bonuses. S 50% SP gain. You get zero unless you have a main character ring. Some of the rings have skills on them, but only at S rank. They come in three ranks. So there are three of those rings at S rank that actually are worthwhile. There's one in particular that's ridiculously good, but it's one character and it's S rank. Oh. 
be literally reading a manga with a naked fox girl as a cover at work. You're too brave. I remember, okay. I brought my Tales of uh, Zine that I recently got. Like, it, it came in in the mail right as I was leaving for work. So I actually brought it with me because I wanted to read it. But I was so, I was so nervous about like a coworker seeing that I had like an anime book that like we have like this thing of like a like a box right and it contains like our stickers for door dashes and like our, our pens and napkins and stuff so I put it underneath that because I'm like no one ever lifts that up <laughs> no one did which is good because I don't want anyone to be like what's this book it eats into bond points, which are important for other things, but you can save scum the rolls. <laughs> I feel you, dwarf. <laughs> I really want to get engaged, man. I want to play engaged so bad. Anyway, I suppose being a detective is my hobby. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I see. Detective work is your hobby. Oh, what? You're taking notes? Oh, where did you get that notebook? Hey, Elio, what a... What are you reading? Turns and stares directly at the person asking, holding up the manga Dick Fight Island. <laughs> <laughs> I wanted to read that manga. I've heard of that manga. What the fuck is that manga? Isn't it a yaoi? Is it a yaoi manga? I don't actually know. I really want to get engaged, man. Elia wants to get married. <laughs> Bro, I don't know. It's called Dick Fight Island. <laughs> they fight with their dicks. <laughs> Yo, dog and roll for two. Sure, it sure changed the last time I played it. Hmm. From my backpack. Mm. Ah, I see. Soka. So your hobby is being a detective, then we should enjoy being that today. Uh, what? Not that. I'm gonna be the detective who'll expose your secret. I take him. <laughs> oh. I thought I was gonna be the detective. Huh? You'll be the, the cute girl that follows the detective, Shuichi. Being interrogated might be a good experience. It'll be useful next time you're in action. Really? Yes. Yep, so now, next question. What's your favorite food? Probably beef bowls. I I'm gonna assume like beef bowls or, or curry. Meat, veggies, fish. Uh, from those choices, ooh, oh, I can choose. Oh, juicy meat, healthy vegetables, or fresh fish. That's a good question. I like fish. Fish and I like meat and I like vegetables. Ooh. I think probably fresh fish. Like salmon. Fresh fish. Fish, huh? I prefer fish over meat too. We're so alike. Let's go. Pika, your lucky vine can't be here during Nakanova. <laughs> Take all my money. That's mine. <laughs> I can't hear you. We're on the meme non-canon minigame. So let me still talk about like spoilers during Danganronpa. So I definitely don't want Barn to be here for that. I mean, we're talking to Kaede as Shuichi. That in, it, that in itself is a spoiler for Barn. Cause he's still on chapter one. <clears throat> yeah. <laughs> then I guess I should worry about our compatibility. What is she muttering about? Yes. Next question. What's your favorite place? That's a pretty broad question. I don't know if I can answer that. Dick Fight Island. Soka. Oh, right. Um, how about... Yeah. If you went out on, like, a date? Where would you go? Movies or the amusement park? Y'all know! Y'all know my experience with movies! I don't want to go on a movie date. I want to go to the amusement park. Amusement park. I refuse to choose the movies. Never take me out to a movie date. 
Especially not as our first date. Amusement park, I suppose. Better catch the bunny while I can. <laughs> I love having no context for this. It's a manga. I'm going to pet peeve. When you say don't spoil this, I get it and I respect it. But also please play it in a timely fashion. I don't know, man. Just me? I'd say it depends on the situation. Yeah. Like, I get it. Like, Barn hasn't played Danganronpa, I, I think, in six months. But also, I get it. Like, you can't enjoy Danganronpa. Well, I, I guess you still can enjoy it, in a way. But I feel like knowing the, the spoilers kind of takes away the enjoyment of it. I had to dodge heavy rain spoilers for a guy I've known for like eight years. Play it, bro. It sucks anyway. Who cares if I spoil it? <laughs> yeah, what was heavy rain? I actually watched a video of a, a speed run actually with Harpy. That was fun. <laughs> Amusement park, I suppose. Uh, Amusement park, huh? You're pretty outgoing. Mm. Yeah, I get that a lot, but. Being a detective is mostly about gathering information, so... Mm hmm, mm, I see. If, if it were, like, a Danganronpa S stream and we talked about V3 spoilers, it'd be natural. But if it's an unrelated game, I feel like it's better to just be careful. Yeah. Like... It's natural to talk about Danganronpa during a Danganronpa stream. Like, if you come into a Danganronpa stream and you get spoiled about Danganronpa, then it's like... Kinda, what were you expecting, I guess? Hmm, I see. She's taking notes again. Yeah. What are you gonna use those notes for? That's... Mm. Yes. I don't know. A secret. Yeah. What? Oh. Don't worry, it won't be used for anything bad. I won't show these notes to anyone else. Yes. Detective Kaide Akamatsu is just getting started. Tell me everything you know, punk. Oh, she's so cute. After Kaide finished questioning me, I returned to my room. It smells like my family's making pizza or something. I don't know what that is. It's not like me. Like pepperoni. Ah, pepperoni, the pepperoni. Good thing you ate today, huh? I ate a hot pocket. Maybe I'll try this one. Yeah, I wanna play Sam and Fishy. Some Sam. Hmm, alright. Yeah, I ate a hot pocket. I will have to survive off of Hot Pockets for the next two weeks. Okay, where's red? Green. Red. RGB or 2D2 
you do that, I will come over and cook you something. But you know, flight tickets are expensive. <laughs> it's okay, I understand. How about I, I'm gonna go to my bank and pray that the reason I only have $60 in my account is because I put a hundred in my savings, I hope. I think I did that, but I'm not sure. I'm so good. I'm not gonna buy anything. Am I using the Mono Emergencies? I feel like that last day didn't use the Mono Emergency. Am I not doing this right? Do I need to toggle it on? Shows them on emergency, so I'm assuming it's being used. Alright. Yo! Can't lose to Monokuma. Let's find a way to escape, Suichi. Yeah. Mm. Hello, Pip Squeakio. Oi! Hi, Poon God 69. Mini God 69. <laughs> How you doing? <laughs> Thank you for the hands. <laughs> All right, let's give you your metronome. Did you guys ever play the the Pokemon Stadium games on N sixty four? <laughs> yes, I loved that game. I had so much fun playing the Clefairy game. And and the Magikarp jumping game. I think that was in Stadium 2, I think? But everyone had the, the part that you could play mini games. I feel like I played that more than the actual stadium. What is this? Remember this. Yes! Unironically, yes. <laughs> Ma'am, I am nine years old. <laughs> I love that game. I felt so powerful when I played with my friends and they messed up. Can I have this thing? <laughs> Time to get super pumped for practice. Mm. Yeah, let's do it. Okay, is this gonna make me cry? Ah, the music changed! Ugh. A piano duet. Two people playing piano together. I think this is her last event. When I was first learning, I didn't quite get it. But now, it feels nice. I played the low notes while Kaide played the high. Together, we played a melody. They're playing the song. Of course, my plane didn't compare, but Kaide carried me. Perhaps that's what gave it a magical sense of unity. At first, I was so focused on Kaide sitting next to me that I couldn't focus. But as we kept playing, it got easier. It felt perfectly natural. Claire de Lune. It's like Kaide and I have become one. Oh, baby. After we finished playing, we remained sitting beside one another, basking in it. Saihara-kun. You're amazing, Shuichi. I can't believe you've improved this much in such little time. Mm. No, I'm not. You literally played Claire de Lune, Shuichi. Hi, baby. I love her. God, this is so bittersweet. I'm glad at least in this universe they have each other still. No, that isn't quite what I want to say. I had a great teacher who showed me the beauty of playing the piano. The beauty of playing the piano? What do you mean? It's so fun to play. 
I understand why you get entranced by it. <laughs> right? Even though it's just us here right now. If someone might hear and it'll make them smile, that's when you know it's worth it. I was only able to have this great experience because I met you, Kaide. I know that this is an abnormal situation, but I'm still so glad that I met you. I had a great teacher who showed me the beauty of playing the piano. Shuichi, I can't believe you said something so embarrassing. Uh, huh? What? I thought that, but I'm glad I met you. But uh, while I was teaching you, I was reminded of how great pianos are. And I started to realize myself what I can do on the piano. Mm. Yeah. Hi, Haruko. Hey, Shuichi. When we get out of here, come over to my house. Eh? Aren't, aren't we moving a bit too fast, Kaede? Your house? Uh, we haven't even, like... I, I, I guess we held hands, but... Uh? Huh? You mean it? Your... house? Mm. Of course. Where else? Well, it's just that... I mean... Going to your house is... Uh... Oh, oh! Wait a minute! No, I, I didn't mean it like that! <laughs> Thank you for the hydrate toy! <laughs> yeah, I need a hydrate after that. It's never too fast. <laughs> Kaide san, it's my first time. Please be gentle. We're gonna play Claire de Lune. Yeah. I wanted us to perform our duet practice on my favorite piano so you could hear it. I knew it. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's what you meant. I'm sorry, I misunderstood. But I also want to talk to you and watch TV with you. You can meet my twin sister. Uh? What? You know how I said I wanted to become closer to you when we got out of here? Um, if it's you, I feel like we could get to know each other a lot more. Does that mean... God damn you, Elio. <laughs> That's why... She's so cute. That's why... Jeez, just be a man and say yes already. Uh, sorry! Yes! 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 <laughs> yes, yes, yes! No, no, no! <laughs> God, they're so cute. We're just not great. We're just not there yet. With our duet, our friendship, everything. Which is why we're going to escape. So we can hopefully grow together. As a romance fan, I'm happy and mad at the same time. Yeah, this is actually like really sweet. I, I really liked their FTEs together. The fact that you can't actually get this in the main game makes me kind of sad. So that it. Yeah, you're right. Kind of understood what Kaide was trying to say. I think that because we have such a strong bond. I think that's because we have such a strong bond between us. But when we get out of here, I might want to take this even further. Oh! <laughs> Go for it, Shuichi. Go for it. I'm rooting for you. You learned a new skill, piano to it. What does that skill do? Poggers. <laughs> Kaide and I spent the rest of the day talking about what to do after we escape. <laughs> and we got Kaide's undergarments. <laughs> Let's go. They're pink. Cute. Beg pardon? <laughs> wow, buddy. <laughs> Still have some time. What should I do? Let's try and get someone else's panties. <laughs> Guess you're gonna miss the panty raid. <laughs> Go a bit fast there, yeah. 
Okay, what, what's her panty description? <laughs> Kaede's favorite panties. A basic and popular pink color with modest lace. And Kirumi's favorite panties. An elegant pair of underwear with deep purple lace. Okay, let, let's read her report card now. She asked me to play a duet with her after I expressed interest in the piano. When we were playing, I felt her body's touch, but she was so absorbed in the music she didn't notice. She truly is a piano freak. <laughs> Kaede says that the reason she plays the piano is because she loves seeing people smile. Because music reaches people's hearts. And in order to see even more smiles, she wants to break the boundaries of music. Today, Kaede asked me all about my interests, like my hobbies and my favorite food. It seemed as though she was taking notes, but she wouldn't tell me what for, so that when you guys are dating, <laughs> she knows what to get you. <laughs> we practiced the duet quite a bit, and it started to sound pretty decent. She blushed at me. She blushed at me when she said she wanted to invite me over to play at her house someday. She said that I would love that. Makes it easier to push the opponent back during the final push. Effective during the bait spawns, huh? It's like Kaide's with you, God. So it's easier to push people back. Okay, oh shit. I thought we were gonna have night time for me to do like the salmon run while we decide who to hang out with next. Oh boy. Let me, let me take a look. No, I'll hang out with Kaito once. And if anyone in chat wants me to hang out with someone else, let me know. And I'll hang out with them. Alright, Kaito. Oh, wait. Let me... Let me check what items you like, actually. Kaito gifts. Anganwampa. Splatine Vogue. Hang out with Twy, please. I'm already hanging out with Twy. Okay, I've got that. You want the the magazine from Donkey Kong One, huh? With the girl with the big old oh. tibbies. Came to invite me, right? Well, of course. You're my sidekick. Mew, suffer. Fine. I'll hang out with Mew. Wait. And look at that, she's right there. She knew. She fucking knew. Okay, Miu liked gifts. What do you like? <laughs> of course she likes the bondage boots, my god. <gasps> Miu. Okay, do I have the bondage boots? I do not have the bondage boots. Suffer. Okay, wearable blanket. Okay, I do have that. She's just a masochist. You what? Yeah, like, even look at what she's wearing. It feels like she's a masochist. <laughs> <laughs> Don't talk to me out of the blue like that. You scared me. I suppose I'll spend time together. At least until I get your underwear. <laughs> now you're just having fun scaring me. You're gonna post it on the internet and animate a gift form and make me a laughing stock. I forgot what my voice was for her. I just wish I could forget everything about her, actually. <laughs> Thank you for the head pad speaker. <laughs> I spent some time trying to convince Miu that I wouldn't do that. Maybe we'll get a satisfying character arc. Maybe. I mean, they, they tend to do that. They tend to do that. With the FTEs. Miu and I grew a little closer today. Would you like to give Miu a present? Yeah. Here's a blanket that you can't move in. You masochist. Uh, what? How did you know I wanted this? <laughs> Don't tell me you're that into me. 
Oh, well, I guess a perma virgin like you can't help but think about... All... Wait, wait, what? I guess perma virgin like you can't help but think about all day long? What? That's... That wording's a little off. Yeah <laughs> I'm a fan-fucking... I'm in a fan-fucking-tastic mood today, too! Sure looks that way. Nandaya. Hey, hey, why the grumpy face? <laughs> I know. He all plugged up, huh? <laughs> this is why I hate talking to Mew. I hate reading her lines. Then let me give you something to get things moving. <laughs> I use Miu in such a good mood. It's a little creepy. Also, hello there, Bionic! Oh, hello, hello! Come, Shuichi, to my research lab. Completely ignoring my confusion, Miu headed to her lab. Now, let's get started. Started? Or what? Ah! Put the shit out of your ears, Pooichi! What? Look at that. Feast your eyes on the latest invention from the genius inventor, Mio Iruma. I'm gonna say something you're not gonna like. She's just power, but slightly more disgusting. How dare you! She is nothing like power. I mean, she kinda is, but shut up. Shut up. Power would never. Mew showed me... Are these... Sunglasses? I mean, power probably would, but shut up. Huh? Not just any sunglasses. These have built-in erotic animations. Movies appear behind the lenses, so you can watch dirty movies anytime, anywhere. <laughs> As a bonus, I included a video of me! Who wants this? I don't want this. I especially don't want your video. Use this too. I bet this will get your blood moving. What is this? I don't know. It's. Shut up, Mew! I hate her! He says while blushing, not to convince. Wait, am I blushing? No. Get, get that off of here. Get that off of here. No. I'm not blushing. In fact, I'm not even smiling. It's a recording of my moans! Uh, what? I recorded a voice sample for you. You're welcome! <laughs> I heard you, like you would never have the chance to hear this voice. <laughs> Is this grounds to file a sexual harassment complaint? Yes. I got other stuff for you, but I don't feel like explaining it all. Just put it to good use, okay? I'm gonna throw it in the garbage. Everything in the box Mew gave me was clearly for that purpose. I I feel like if I ever used anything you gave me for that purpose, I would rather die. <laughs> Thank you for the head pats, Twy, but I'm getting rid of the blush. <laughs> I I like her. I mean not cop. <laughs> Be happy. I need all this stuff for you. <laughs> for me? Oh. Don't men need this kind of stuff? I just want STD. Come on. No. <laughs> you can't get anything done if you're always plugged up. It's weird to be handed this stuff out of nowhere, whether I need it or not. I am a bit taken aback by how nice Miu is being, though. Arigato. Uh, um... Thank you? <laughs> <laughs> See? Being honest ain't so bad now, is it? I like how honest you are. Since it's you... Oh. What? I guess I can share my secret with you. What's your secret? <clears throat> your secret? I don't really want to hear it. <laughs> I'll listen, but no more inventions. I'll listen, but no more inventions. Will you take these back, please? Huh? You don't want my inventions? Are you sure you're even a dude? 
anyway. Down into the toilet they go. I still have some time. What should I do? I guess I'll hang out with you. Actually, maybe Ryoma. Give it to Ryoma? Is Elio being killed or something? Nah, he's just suffering. After Mew. Okay, do I still have... Yeah, I still have enough of the... The thing. Okay, she's over here, right? There you are. Look, there has to be some kind of payoff, hopefully. I'm praying she has a good character arc. So, we're just skipping Clarkeo, right? I wish. Yeah, fuck that guy. I want to see all of the FTEs. Even if I hate... Koi Kyo. I still will see his events, unfortunately. Seriously, I can tell by your face just how pent up and frustrated you are. Okay, then you can't complain. You were gonna do this anyway. I know, but that I can still complain. You're like the poster child for abstinence only education. Checkmate, checkmark gamers. You probably have pervy dreams while you're sleeping, huh? Then have I got something for you? Stop! Stop giving me your inventions! <laughs> it's my newest invention! The dream writing machine! This baby will record the pervy scenes in your dreams down to the last sordid detail. I don't need this. All I dream about is me climbing up a tree. Because, like, there are crabs all over the floor and I don't want to get pinched. With this, you won't forget a single millisecond of your pervy dreams. It doesn't have to be D-Gen dreams. Then why does it? Why does she say it like this? <laughs> what do you think? It's perfect for an uncut bastard like you. Because it's me. <laughs> we spent some time testing her inventions. Why? No. I don't want to! You and I grew a little closer today. I guess I'll give Miu a present. Why? The things I do for 100% completion. Huh? I, I... I... wanted this... so bad. Yeah Not bad, Perma Virgin. When are you planning to slip some flip between... What? <laughs> No! Shut up! Based. I don't want to say this so loud. When are you planning to slip some flip between these big old titties? How do I bonk a video game character, right? God. Gonta should have been faster. <laughs> well, if you're tugging it to me, I guess I can let this slide. Ah. Oh. Oh, Shuichi, you came to hear my secret, didn't ya? You're the first person I've ever shared this with. So, I might have some trouble saying it, right? I like her. <laughs> what on earth is Flip? I don't want to know. <laughs> At least she's honest what she wants. <laughs> You're acting strangely. This might be important. She's not making sexual innuendos every second. 
I don't know. I'll just tell you straight off. To be honest, I... I'm not a normal person. I know that. I know you're a D-Gen. Oh, good, you're with me. <laughs> oh, good, you're with me. Of course. I'm not so dense that I can't tell what makes me weird. Then, um, I not do something to change? I don't know. Because I need someone else to assure me that I really am weird. Bro, you gave me, like, Glasses with like videos of you in lewd situations. That's weird. Yeah. You really are weird. Nandaka. Seriously? How did you know? Wait, she just wants me to call her weird. Let me guess. She get. She probably has like a degradation. <laughs> Don't change, please. <laughs> so it's pretty clear, huh? You can tell just by looking that I'm an augmented human. An augmented human? Didn't realize she was talking about something like that. What? Hey, I'm with it already. N no, I mean, I can't really tell. Huh? Huh? Then why the fuck did you even say that shit in the first place? I don't know. Cause you're degenerate. <laughs> Anyway, you probably won't believe me, but... Back in the day, I used to be a boring, unremarkable girl with no talent at all. Mm. One day, I got in an accident and ended up in a coma. Damn, I wish you stayed in your coma. <laughs> Real life and death type shit. Anyway, after the surgery, I barely managed to regain consciousness. I'm sorry, Miu. <laughs> I, to be completely honest, I like her really, really much more than I should. <laughs> Pika! Pika! And ever since, I've been chock full of ideas for all kinds of inventions. Dude, I thought she was about to admit she was trans. Here's your trans rep, bro. If only. And I had the brains, skills, and physical talent to make those inventions a reality. But that's weird, isn't it? I mean, think about it. It's weird, right? Although, knowing how Danganronpa is with its uh, representation, it's probably good that they don't have a trans character. It would probably make them the butt of a joke. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> weird. Pika, I think it's because you didn't see her in the main story. No, I, I think Pika would still like her in the main story. <laughs> So, I've come to the conclusion that I am, in fact, an, uh, an augmented human. Uh, an augmented human. As Professor Oak said, Red, there's a time and place for everything. <laughs> oh. That's right. The surgery augmented me somehow. That's how I survived the coma. Just... You got brain surgery. Wait, no. That... That can't be the case. You're definitely human, Miu. Kibo picture feature is all I'll say. <laughs> Means she's a freaking genius. She can build you whatever you want, like the next gen console. I mean, she did make an Xbox. Oh. Sure, I do normal human stuff, like eat and take shits, but. I mean, look at Kibo. If someone can make a robot that passes for human. Oh, it is so much fun! Augmented human! <laughs> this is amazing! Uh, is this something to get excited about? Oh. Of course! Superpowers are within my reach! Or should I say, literally within me? Yeah, that's it! I got the power inside me! We better start cutting me open! Mew. Chotto. I know you're a masochist, but please. What? You would die! Augmented human! It'll take more than disembowelment to kill me. You might be bizarre, but she's still human. Yeah! <laughs> I just gotta jam this baby into me. Stop! You brandished a wrench and swung it up into the air. Oi. Wait, stop! Is she gonna hit herself? <gasps> I 
frantically grabbed her hand to stop her. It doesn't matter if you're augmented or not. You're a living, breathing human being, Miu. So you can't hurt yourself like this. Sweetie? What are you saying? How else can I satisfy my lust for research? I can't let you do this, Miu. Why? Why are you looking at me like that? What? What? Uh, don't touch me! Uh, Miu? Is she like getting a crush on Shuichi or something? I think she needs a caretaker. I volunteer. <laughs> Miu left in a hurry. I watched her go and I returned to my room. Hope she's okay. Hope she's not doing something stupid. Ah, yes. Ah, yes. The perverted speaker that is actually super shy. I think she needs an undertaker. An overtaker. <laughs> Alright. Time for more salmon fishing. It's gonna, it's gonna take me forever to get enough coins for a love hotel. Pika wants to be Mew's caretaker, and Pika is Elio's maid. I see a pattern. Oi. But what are you implying? Oi. I don't like... I don't like that. Nothing, Mew. Oi! I'm not Mew! I may be a degenerate, but I'm not the degenerate! Mew, Mew has like a a permanently loaded card that just like refreshes itself, and I'm just like, yeah, this is where I stop. This is where I get off the degenerate trade. Green. I would look at chat, but I I gotta keep my eye on the the fishies. are not comparable, I'm afraid. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not bad, but I'm not that bad. She's one of those who can speak about everything perverted and can't imagine it, but the moment it actually happened, you know, she's literally not able to do anything because she's way too embarrassed. Maybe she is like, you know, yeah, but she doesn't use her genius the best way. I might find that really cute, help. <laughs> okay, let me, let me get rid of the, <laughs> the head cats. Okay, not gonna trade anything yet, unless, okay. I still got mon emergency, so I'm still good. Alright, time to hang out with Miu again. I still have a blanket, right? I think I had three. Just double check. Not even sure if buying the love hotel keys are worth it. Okay, yeah, I still have enough for one more. I just realized. Hmm. Oh, maybe not. I'm surprised Mew's not that close to Kibo here on the world map. I mean, she kind of is. <laughs> Come here, the big needle, you worship. 
at my big, beautiful titties. No! No! <laughs> Fine, just keep your smelly virgin hands where I can see them. Otherwise, you have my permission. Alright! Stare at them all you want till your eyes change color. Shut up. <laughs> yes, me. <laughs> Okay, you know what? I'm gonna step up to bat for you here. If Bowser said that, you would be fine with it. Bowser would not say that. Bowser's not that type of a man. The dialogue in this game is wild. Yeah. <laughs> they, they sure went all out with this game. I, I feel like the other Rumpel games weren't as down bad. Like, I know he Fumi me and Teru Teru exist, but he has a son, Elio. He's used goods. But he's a gentleman. <laughs> I mean, he's a villain. He kidnaps women and puts them in his towers, but he's a gentleman. Sushinsa. Uh, I spent a lot of time looking at Miu, waiting for my eyes to change color. God, she really is like power, isn't she? I hate it! Miu and I grew a little closer today. I hate that you made that comparison, dwarf. Yeah, here, here's your here's your blanket. Bowser is a gentleman. He doesn't even wear pants. Exactly. He kidnaps women. You're not a target. That's true. Not does he not all. have giant titties? He does have giant titties, but he wouldn't he wouldn't like make a note about it. You know? He would just be like, yeah. Like I don't know. They. Like, he puts things eloquently, I would think. What? Yeah, I, I think I already said this line. Yeah, I did. <laughs> I was worried about Miu and her augmented story, so I went to talk to her. She seems down. Bad. She must be thinking hard about something. Uh, Miu? What? Don't talk down to me! N no, I'm worried about you. Okay, but Elio, you'd love it if Kirumi spoke like you. I would not, actually. I tend to not like... Like, the pervs. In, in games, like... Like, Miu is not exclusive from this. I feel the same way about Hifubi and Teru Teru. Like, if you're, like, being, like, a big pervo, I, I'm not... I'm not a fan of it. Like, you gotta, you gotta, like, have an air of fantasy about you. <laughs> like, it's the chase that makes it fun. But if you're, you're just, I don't know. No, I'm worried about you. Aww. I just don't like curves. I just don't like curves. <laughs> Elio down, abysmal, buggy, boring, lappy. Oi! Uh, worried? You worried about me? Whatever you say, Mew, Iruma, Elio. Ay! Your voice cracked. But, but uh, I, I'm fine. I'm not that upset. Hold up. But you were talking about being augmented before. But, oh. so, so what? Even if I am human, it, it's not your problem. Mm. I suppose you're right. To me, you're still Mew. <laughs> <laughs> How can you say that? What? Mew, your face is red. Is something wrong? Uh, uh, <laughs> nothing's wrong. Why is it hot? Are you hot? I'm hot. Oh, she has a crush on him, doesn't she? I guess I gotta take my, off my clothes now. It's not right. Okay, off they go. Uh, what? Wait. Uh, <laughs> I'm letting it all hang out. Stop! Th then you take it off. Take off your clothes. No, stop! Uh? Why? Uh, stop! I'm not reading this! I am not reading this! I refuse! You don't have to. I am not reading that. I'm not reading that. <laughs> Read it yourself. What are you talking about? And hey, hands off! You, 
What's wrong? Are you worried about something? No. Huh? Switch, you blockhead! What does a genius like me need to worry about? <laughs> Would it be weird if I was worried, though? Mm. It wouldn't be weird at all, Miu. Even geniuses worry about things. It's so... But it's just heartache. She has a crush on him. <clears throat> what? Heartache. I see. So that's what's wrong. <laughs> yeah, I'm falling for you. Uh, what? Me? Huh? You said it first. That you're so worried about me. Because you're in love with me. Uh, that was not what I meant. Yeah. I never said that. <laughs> huh? You did it? Please say psych me. Mm. No, I didn't. Uh, ah! Wipe out. <laughs> you space somehow got even redder and she ran off wailing. Didn't you just confess her love to me? Okay. <laughs> Mew is long gone. I return to my room, dumbfounded. What should I say when I see her again? Okay, so we're out of the blankie. Alright, well, four out of five, it's looking bad, but this is the one that'll tie it all together, boys. <laughs> Will I like Mew at the end of this? Let's find out. I still have some time. What should I do? Okay, what, what other things does she like? Story of Tokono. Do I have that? Okay, what number is that? 39. Miku. Miku da yo! Okay. Oh, I do. A collection of stories about customs, legends, and knowledge of civilizations from long ago it has a high scientific value. I'm surprised you read this, Mew. I thought you would want to read the Big Tibby book. You know, I can respect that. I can respect you when you're being a science queen. I just saw the no, FF7 upload. <laughs> yep, I used it. See how you scribbled over the timestamp I made for the picture? Yeah, because it, it it wasn't quite the same timestamp for YouTube. <laughs> Why are you asking me out? Like, you even have a shot with me. Learn your fucking place. You just confessed your love to me, Mew. Your worth as a human being is set in stone from the day you're born. <laughs> it is a solid color background. You did it in the worst method. Me Wait, did I do it bad? I shouldn't even notice that. Wait, I'm gonna pull it up. I think I still have the image saved on Gimp. It's noticeable, is it? Comparing us to a bra size? For fuck's sake. <laughs> Hold on. I'm gonna R men riding woman. <laughs> if you were bra size, you'd be a C at most. Yeah, then this is a real men riding woman moment. Dong and Wompa. Oh, okay, yeah, I can kind of see it, actually. Fuck. Damn it. Now I have to fix it. Now I have to fix it. Like, next time you do that, just take the background next to it and just stretch it to be bigger. Yeah, I should have done that. I just thought it was a solid black background. <laughs> it's the same color. She is like above average. So she's complimenting me. At least she's not saying I'm flat. Why did she compare it to bra size? Okay, let, let's see if 
Miu can redeem herself from all the moments of making me want to die reading her lines. Probably not. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna fix this right now. I got Gimp open. Okay, I fixed it. I fixed it. I will upload this to YouTube right now. I... I need to do this. It's my honor. It's my honor. I don't want anyone else to see it. A compliment, for sure. Kinda. <laughs> She's saying you're not Justice, so you're not Kida. <laughs> Hi, Ugg, I'm Twy. <laughs> okay, did that, did that export? I think that exported. Yeah, overwrite thumbnail. Okay, I'm changing the thumbnail right now. I'm sorry, I know I'm streaming. I should just do this when I'm done streaming, but... There, it's fixed. I am literally the only human being who would notice that, and that's because I need the image. Listen. <laughs> the moment I see a mistake, I'm like, shit. I spent some time talking about my value as a human being with me. Take your time. I'm sure we're all frothing at the mouth to see what awful garbage is gonna fall out of this creature's mouth. <laughs> me and I grew a little closer today. Yeah, I guess I'll give you a present. A scientific book. Don't do that when you see me, though. <laughs> no, I'm Don't not talk not. about Elio about like that. Oh, wait, me. <laughs> what? How did you. Oh, yeah, I already read this. <laughs> Still thinking about Mew's confession. I couldn't come up with a plan. Why the sad, miserable face? I guess I was the only one worried about it. <laughs> Since you look so bummed out, I got you a present. Is it another invention? <laughs> <laughs> what a crazy idea. I almost feel sorry for you. Right. I, Miyuruma, will show you just how versatile I really am. So here, take this. Right. Is this a pie? That's actually kind of cute! Oh. Yep, it's an apple pie. I baked it from scratch myself. That's actually kind of cute. I'm not gonna lie. Oh shit, let her cook. <laughs> I'd honestly gift her a 100 pack of tissues. <laughs> her drooling must be a real pain in the ass. What did she lace the pie with? Oh no! Please, just be a, just be an innocent apple pie, please. Let her cook. Didn't think she would bring me a pie. It looks really professional. Mio must be a pretty good cook. Impressed, I inspected the pie, that's when I find, ah, uh, no. Uh, Mew? Is this a hair? That's just an innocent pie too. What is this? <laughs> no! Why would you do this? <laughs> Don't worry. I added some hidden ingredients. Oh no, never mind. Why? Don't worry. I'm gonna worry about hair in my food. I just want the person I like to eat me. What? Autobot. Boy. <laughs> Hair pie. <laughs> I, I mean more too. Cookies with my fingernails, chocolates with my blood. Stop. No. I mean cookies with your blood isn't that bad, I guess. Well, at the very least, it means that her confession was genuine. She's, like, uh, coming on a little strong. Uh-oh, she's staring at me. She wants me to eat it. Don't eat hair pie! 
Okay, see, look, she's just a freak. Elliot, that's definitely pretty bad. I've, I've seen people... I've seen people make chocolate and mix their blood in it. I'm not surprised by this, actually. <laughs> Um, I'm really honored that you made this for me, but I'm concerned about the hygiene. Yeah, it's like a popular young dead day. Uh, it's like a, it's like a, it's like a young dead day thing that like a, a lot of young dead days do. They like, I cooked you this chocolate. I mixed my blood with it. <laughs> so I'm not as surprised by that. Same with hair though. Blood's just a liquid. <laughs> I only heard hair, never blood. Really? I feel like blood makes more sense to cook with than with hair. She really made it with her blood, sweat, and tears. So kind. <laughs> I'm scared that you meant like Iro. No, no, no. It's just like a, a young dead archetype. Yeah, same hair. I was expecting the hair thing to go south. Yeah. <laughs> You got a lot of balls to lecture me. But, you know, even a genius like me should be more careful with the stuff I make. Don't make me remember DDLC, please. Figuratory and literally. Ha ha ha. If anything happened to you, I might go crazy. <laughs> if that happened, the world would never recover. Right? Isn't that right? I interpret it as literally. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh well, I'll just have to make you something else. <laughs> what? Yeah, yeah, I know. There's actual dishes made with blood, so I'm not too weirded out. But like, still be freaky thinking about eating someone's blood. Yeah. Like, out of hair, fingernails, and blood, if I had to choose one of the three to eat, I would choose the blood. Because it's liquid, and like if you cooked it into something, you probably wouldn't notice. You brush right past fingernail, like the fuck is wrong with you? <laughs> what? Yeah! The time has finally come to use this! Like you would notice right away if your food had like hair and nails in it, but would you notice if there was blood? I don't know. I don't know if I could actually notice. Wait, are we admitting the fact she had to get the blood from somewhere? No! Don't! No! Point of view, you're talking to a Yandere enthusiast. <laughs> the nails could be crushed. Still, it would be like hard. She's strapped. There's a good old pretty normal decision of not eating your nails. <laughs> like, okay, if I was forced to eat a meal with hair, fingernails, or blood. I would choose blood. Blood is more concerning to me because she has to get it. That's true. Mia whipped out the ray gun from earlier. Right. Time to go commando. She took aim and then... Oh. A piece of fabric suddenly materialized in my hand. What? I remember correctly. I think I know what this is. <laughs> what do you think of that, Chuichi? Can you feel my residual heat? Shut <laughs> I think you're biased given previous discussions, oi. Yes, yes I can! Mika. You get it now? You've earned the right to date me! Uh. Let's hope it's blood from a cut. I, I was hoping no one would talk about it possibly being her period blood. I don't want to think about that. I've what? Look at that. When we get out of here, you're going on a date with me. Got it? It's already decided. Ugh. I don't want to go on a date with a girl that tries to make me eat a pie with her hair in it. It is? <laughs> da doy If you go on a date with me, I'll just explode with excitement. If you turn me down, the world will never recover. Understand? Okay, this is actually kind of cute. That's kind of cute, but I mean, you gave me a pie with your hair in it. You're the only guy in the world who's ever made me feel this good. So, you better take responsibility for what you've done. 
This is such a huge whiplash compared to Shuichi's bonding time with Kaede, right? Shuichi and Kaede's bonding time was so nice and sweet. But here she comes in with her, <laughs> her apple pie. Her hair apple pie. This is how Miyu expresses her feelings, I see. Mm. Alright, I understand. Please don't make me eat your cooking, though. <laughs> it's a date. You promised. Better not forget. <laughs> <laughs> Miyu smiled, but I returned it with something more akin to a grimace. At the same time, she is showing me a lot of affection. I am happy that I was able to make this kind of connection with Miyu. Am I? Oh, no, very nervous about this, but still. I guess the system here is good one to bad one. We only have a few bad ones, but eh, but is that a good thing? <laughs> yeah. The, the next one will be better. Ryoma, Ryoma seems like a reasonable man. I'm sure it'll be okay. We'll get out of here together. Now I gotta read her report card. Blech. I got the XXX ray goggles, of fucking course. I was gonna say Ryoma, maybe we should just go thank Gonta for ending this foul thing. <laughs> Gonta, you did God's work killing you. I then spent some time listening to New Year's delusional date ideas. <laughs> That's actually kind of cute. Oh. I don't know. I'm like whiplashy. Like this freaks me the fuck out, Mew. I hate you, Mew. And then she does something where I'm like, oh, that's actually kind of cute. That is thought he said it's okay. It's okay. I'm gonna get out of here. <laughs> I still like her. I can fix her. I love you. No, I don't think I can fix her. I don't think I. I don't think I have that ability. I'm sorry. I don't. I won't. I'm not touching that. I'm not touching that with a five foot pole. <laughs> she gifted me some of her inventions, but I wasn't sure how to react to them. She seemed to be happy that I was grateful for them though, and told me a secret she hadn't shared with anybody. Ever since her car accident left her teetering between life and death, she'd been getting a steady stream of ideas for inventions. She claims this is evidence that she's a cyborg, and I barely managed to calm her down. I can fix her and God really I should. I can fix her, making it worse on purpose. Elio has a five foot pole, sure Yuki was right. <laughs> Mew's moods are fickle and wild. She took her clothes off and tried to get me to take mine off too. She's behaving stranger than usual lately. When I told her I was worried about her, she said she loved me. She expresses her love in strange ways. I honestly don't know how to handle it. She even gave me her panties and told me that she wants to go on a date with me when we get out. What? Once part of an object becomes invisible, the entire object will be shown. Effective during imagination excavation. That, that's kind of OP, actually. Uh, but anyway. Little man. Little man. Take me by the hand. Please. Please don't be a freak. Please don't be a freak. Anyway, uh, what, what's our time at? Two hours? Jesus, he's so fucking little. He's just a little dude. He's just a little dude, like... Hold on, I need to compare him to Monokuma. They're like the same, they're like the same height. Three apples tall. He really is. Like, look at his head. Like, one head, two head, three head. He's like... Just three heads tall. You can just check Ryoma's bio. The the heights are in there. It's like a little Digimon. Yeah, what, how tall is he? Please, please have me be taller than him. Okay, I'm taller than him. He's three foot five inches. Thank God. Thank God I'm taller. At last. He likes Russian blues. Based. Yeah, based. <laughs> see your comment. <laughs> but anyway, uh, well, hmm. I'll go on a date with 
hiding. Just, just to wash off. Just to wash off the dirt. Yeah, let's go on a date. Elio's only taller than him in game. I am taller than him in reality, too! Okay, let's go to the AV room. Alright. I am gonna be a bastard. And Nah, I don't feel like it actually. I'll just I'll just answer whatever. Calling back to Kaide, literally a wash in the stink of another woman. <laughs> we decided to hang out in the AV room. Why do you smell so bad? <laughs> Looks like we're the only ones here. What should we do? Watch a documentary on pianists. Yeah, I think she'd like that. When I watch these, I get really pumped. Performance isn't a competition, but I refuse to lose. Yes. All right, I'm gonna practice once I return to my research lab. I think this conversation went well. Thank you, Kaide. Well, that was enjoyable. Why do I have so much fun hanging out with you? She's gonna bully you into a recital and you're gonna push her down the stairs. <laughs> no! Maybe you know how to make it fun for other people, Shuichi. <laughs> She's already died by hanging once, dwarf. Don't make her die by hanging again. Okay, let's head back to the dorms. Okay, that's not confirmed. She literally got shown to be hanging from a noose. Kaide, at least. I, we know that... We know that who we are referencing did not commit the suicide. Yeah, it didn't kill her. They just set it up to make it look like that. She could have... Yeah, I think she was dead. She was definitely dead before they hanged her. Like... They had... <laughs> it is unsure, but I sure hope so. I... 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 <laughs> God. Could you imagine... That, like, she wasn't dead, but them being like, Okay, let's like, make it look like she committed suicide was actually the reason she died. That would be sad. Anyway, uh, let's not talk about that anymore. Uh, but yeah. Uh, that was it for Dong and Rompu. Hey, let's check to make sure Kaide didn't actually die from being hung. Yeah. Anyway, uh... If I recall, there was blood on the wooden shard, so I personally think she died from impact. Yeah. Yeah, like... She's not the first person that died from being, uh... Pushed down the stairs. But anyway. Anyway, anyway, anyway. Uh, that is gonna be it for the day, everyone. Uh, I hope that you have a good night. Next time we play Danganronpa will probably be the Mario Party mini game game. Raise some more characters so we can go through Monokuma's Dungeon of Madness. Failed the 50-50. <laughs> no, I, I, I succeeded at the 50-50. Anyway, uh, I'll see you guys later. Uh, have a good night. I'll maybe see you tomorrow when I get home from work. I'm not sure. Oh, uh, but I will say, um, not sure what streams are gonna look like this week. Again, I'm not making schedules, uh, but, uh, I will at the very least, uh, be doing a stream on Monday night, uh, but it won't be on my channel. It'll be on Omni Jare Bear's channel. So, let me just, uh, how do you do the shout out thing? how you spell his name, right? I hope so. Yeah, yeah, that is him. So yeah, uh, I'll be on his channel on Monday uh, doing an improv thing. And there's gonna be another VTuber and I think he's looking for some other guests too. So yeah, uh, be sure to follow them in anticipation for a uh, good thing on Monday. I think it's gonna be at 9 p.m. PST, so I know it's gonna be a bit late for most of you guys, but if you're able to make it, that'd be cool. It's been a while since I've done improv, so I think that'll be fun. 
But anyway, uh, that'll be it for the night, everyone. And see you guys later. Have a good night. Be sure to eat, drink, take your medication, and check mark gamers. Thanks for the stream, you